From melons worth more than a luxury car to tea that's 30 times more valuable than gold, these aren't just foods. They're symbols of status, reserved for those with the means to indulge in the extraordinary. But what exactly makes these ingredients so expensive? Is it their rarity, the meticulous craftsmanship behind them, or the prestige they represent? Welcome back to Stella Eureka. Today, we'll unlock the secrets behind the world's 25 most expensive ingredients and discover why they're quite literally worth their weight in gold. Almas Caviar. The ocean has always sparked our imagination with tales of pirate treasures and sunken ships, hiding riches deep below the surface. Just like those stories, the seas also hold some of the most expensive and rarest foods in the world. These prized seafood delicacies are not only famous for their incredible flavors, but also for how rare they are. We begin our journey into the world of the most expensive foods with Alma's caviar, often regarded as the pinnacle of luxury ingredients. While most people are familiar with the high price of caviar, Almas caviar stands apart as the most expensive caviar in the world. With its shimmering golden hue and delicate pearls, this rare and exquisite delicacy is harvested from albino beluga sturgeon that have swum in the pristine waters of the Caspian Sea for over 60 to 100 years. The rarity of these sturgeons, combined with the meticulous care required to harvest their eggs, makes Alma's caviar not only the most expensive caviar, but also one of the most expensive foods on the planet. Available at exclusive locations, such as Caviar House and Prunier in London's Piccadilly, this luxury ingredient is presented in tins adorned with 24 karat gold, emphasizing its status. What truly sets Alma's caviar apart is its remarkable flavor. With a rich, nutty taste and creamy texture, it offers a luxurious experience like no other. Unlike other types of caviar, Alma's is less salty and smoother, perfect for those seeking a refined and elegant taste. As the sturgeon aid, their road develops even more complex and nuanced flavors, making each bite a rare indulgence. Priced between $11,000 and $16,000 per pound, Alma's caviar is the ultimate expensive ingredient, a symbol of wealth, status and indulgence, reserved for only the most exclusive events and elite palates. It's one of the most prestigious and sought after delicacies in the world, setting a high bar for luxury ingredients. Coffin Bay King Oysters. From the pristine waters of Coffin Bay, Australia, we move on to one of the largest oysters in the world, the Coffin Bay King Oysters. These giants can grow up to an impressive 2.2 pounds and measure about seven inches in length. These massive oysters aren't just known for their size. Years of careful cultivation and nurturing in pristine waters turn them into a luxurious delicacy. Over six to seven years, these oysters are nurtured in crystal clear waters using a unique rack and rail farming system. This method allows the oysters to be regularly raised and lowered by the tide, which strengthens their muscles, much like how exercise develops muscles in other living organisms. In a way, it's like putting the oysters through their own workout routine. This not only contributes to their ability to stay fresh longer, but also enhances their rich, buttery texture and sharp briny flavor that seafood aficionados adore. The labor-intensive process, extended growth period, and their exceptional taste contribute to their hefty price tag of around $100 each. Indulging in a Coffin Bay King Oyster isn't just about tasting a rare delicacy. It's like taking a bite of the ocean itself, a pure reflection of the untouched waters and pristine environment where these oysters grow. Bluefin Tuna. Next, we dive into one of the most expensive seafood cuts in the world, the bluefin tuna otoro. Revered in the world of sushi, otoro is the richest, most decadent cut from the belly of the Pacific bluefin tuna. While the Coffin Bay oysters are celebrated for their size and strength, and Alma's caviar for its refined delicacy, otoro stands out for its intense marbling and melt-in-your-mouth texture offering a different kind of indulgence entirely. Bluefin tuna, particularly otoro, is often sold at jaw-dropping prices in Japan's renowned fish markets. In fact, a single bluefin tuna once sold for an astonishing 3.1 million at auction, a price driven by its prestige and rarity. The value of otoro is further increased by its limited availability 
as only a small portion of the tuna yields this prized premium cut. The Pacific Bluefin tuna is both wild caught and sustainably farmed, with strict regulations in place to prevent overfishing and ensure the species' survival. These measures help maintain the luxury and exclusivity of bluefin tuna otoro while protecting the population of the fish, whether farmed or caught in the wild. The process of obtaining otoro remains complex and labour intensive, further driving up its value. The scarcity of bluefin tuna, combined with the difficulty of farming or catching these prized fish, elevates the status of otoro. Its buttery texture and rich marbling create a melt-in-your-mouth experience that secures its place among the world's most expensive and sought-after seafood treasures. Golden Alaskan King Crab The oceans of Alaska are home to some of the finest delicacies, and the Golden Alaskan King Crab is no exception. Known for its stunning golden orange shell and slightly spikier exterior, this crab may be smaller than its red king cousin, but its sweet, delicate flavour sets it apart. Often weighing between 5 and 8 pounds, the Golden King Crab is prized for its tender, mildly sweet meat, which is less briny than other crabs. Harvesting these crabs is no small feat. Found primarily in the deep waters of the Aleutian Islands, these crabs are harder to catch, contributing to higher prices. Sustainability is key in the Alaskan King Crab industry and the harvest is tightly regulated to protect the species and ensure that only the finest crabs make it to the plates of those fortunate enough to experience this rare delicacy. A serving of this expensive seafood can cost upwards of $180 for a few legs. But for seafood lovers, the price is well worth the indulgence. Fugu after exploring the luxury of the golden Alaskan king crab, we now turn to a tasty, deadly delicacy, fugu or Japanese pufferfish. Known not just for its delicate flavour, but also for the deadly tetrodotoxin it contains, a poison so potent that improper preparation can be fatal. This toxin is 1,000 times more potent than cyanide. Each year, around 20 to 50 cases of fugu poisoning occur in Japan with up to six fatal occurrences happening each year. These are mostly due to home preparation by non-certified individuals. This fish requires extreme precision and skill in its preparation. Only highly trained, government-certified chefs are allowed to serve this dish, making it a rare and exclusive culinary experience. Despite the danger, fugu remains a revered delicacy across Japan, prized for its light, clean flavour and its unique, chewy texture. It is often served as thinly sliced sashimi, a traditional Japanese dish consisting of raw fish or seafood served without rice. For those adventurous enough to try it, some may even experience a slight tingling sensation from the tiny trace amounts of toxin that remain after careful preparation. This adds to both the thrill and the mystique of enjoying this rare dish. Given the skill required to prepare it safely and the rarity of wild-caught varieties, the price can soar, with high-end restaurants charging up to $200 per serving. For those seeking an unforgettable, once-in-a-lifetime dining experience, Fugu delivers a combination of risk, rarity and refinement. After exploring the ocean's most expensive food, it's time to leave the waves behind and head to the land, where some of the rarest and most expensive fruits and vegetables are grown. These fruits and vegetables aren't just about flavour, they're about exclusivity. Grown in precise conditions, each one carries a hefty price tag, making them true symbols of luxury. From perfectly cultivated Japanese melons to rare, sought-after potatoes, these foods are as valuable as they are delicious. Yubari King Melon We start with one of the finest symbols of luxury, the Yubari King Melon exclusively grown in the small city of Yubari, Hokkaido, in Japan. This melon represents more than just a fruit. It's a true symbol of prestige, perfection and the art of Japanese cultivation. What sets the Yubari King melon apart isn't just its vibrant orange flesh or the honey-like sweetness that melts in your mouth. It's the meticulous cultivation process that elevates it to luxury status. Each melon is carefully tended to by dedicated farmers who ensure that every single fruit develops the intricate, delicate netting that covers its rind, an indicator of quality and perfection. The price? 
Well, a single melon can easily cost between $50 to $100, but that's just the baseline. In an auction, a pair of Yubari melons once sold for nearly $30,000. These fruits aren't just for eating. They're often given as high-status gifts, making them a symbol of luxury in Japanese culture. But why Yubari king melon is so expensive? The answer lies in the unparalleled care that goes into growing each melon. They're cleaned, inspected, and pampered every day to ensure that they reach peak ripeness in just over 100 days. Only the most flawless melons, with perfectly formed netting and sweetness, make it to the market. Outside of Japan, getting your hands on one of these melons is a challenge. They're rare even in Tokyo, typically found only in high-end grocers. If you do manage to find one, be prepared to part with a few hundred dollars and don't wait too long to enjoy it. These melons have a short shelf life, making them a fleeting but unforgettable indulgence. La Bonotta Potato One of the most exclusive and expensive vegetables on earth is a potato. Yes, you heard that right. The La Bonotte Potato often dubbed the diamond of the potato world, comes from the small island of Noirmoutier off the coast of France. But what makes this humble spud worth up to $270 per pound, making it the most expensive potato in the world? The secret lies in its unique growing conditions. These rare potatoes thrive in the sandy, mineral-rich soil, fertilized with seaweed from the Atlantic Ocean, giving La Bonotte its distinct salty, slightly sweet flavor with hints of lemon. Unlike typical potatoes, La Bonnot is so delicate that it must be harvested by hand, which significantly increases labour costs. Adding to its exclusivity, La Bonnot is only harvested during a short 10-day window each year in early May. Each plant yields a mere 7 ounces of potatoes on average, making them a true rarity. The intricate hand-picking process, limited yield, and unique growing conditions all contribute to the high price tag, often served in France's finest restaurants, where it's paired with the likes of caviar or simply prepared with a touch of butter to let its natural flavor shine. Densuke Watermelon. We return to Japan, this time to uncover one of the most mysterious and luxurious fruits in the world, the Densuke Watermelon. With its jet black exterior and striking contrast to its sweet red interior, the Densuke watermelon is truly an anomaly in both appearance and price, setting it apart in the world of fruits. What makes the Densuke watermelon so expensive? As with many of the other expensive foods we've explored, its scarcity is a key factor. Cultivated exclusively in the small town of Toma, Japan, this rare melon thrives in the island's mineral-rich volcanic soil. Introduced as a new crop in 1981, it quickly gained recognition and by 1989, the name Densuke became a trademark reserved only for the finest and most pristine specimens. Growing these melons is no easy task. The process is labour intensive, requiring plenty of space, water and care. Each Densuke watermelon is hand turned on the vine to ensure even growth and a blemish free surface. Then they are meticulously polished after harvest to achieve its signature glossy black sheen, resembling a perfect bowling ball. In 2008, this iconic watermelon set a record when a 17-pound Densuka was sold at auction for a staggering 650,000 yen, or about $6,000. These watermelons aren't just food, they're symbols of luxury, often found in high-end fruit boutiques that treat them like priceless gems. If you're outside Japan and dream of experiencing the Densuke watermelon's unparalleled sweetness, growing your own might give you a good tasting result. However, only those grown in Hokkaido can officially be called Densuke watermelons. Their combination of rarity, perfection, and the care required in their cultivation makes them one of the most expensive fruits in the world. Lotus Seed Pods More than just an eye-catching plant structure, this food is a symbol of both beauty and nutrition, deeply rooted in Asian culinary traditions, often found in shallow ponds and lakes, particularly across parts of Asia and North America. The lotus plant offers several edible parts, but its seeds are especially prized. Lotus seeds aren't just collected, they're foraged from the wild in an intense, time-consuming process, making them a prized ingredient in traditional Asian cuisine. The pods must be carefully collected and the seeds extracted and cleaned before they're ready for consumption. 
The seeds are rich in protein and other nutrients, making them a popular snack or ingredient in various dishes. They can be eaten raw, toasted or ground into flour for cooking. However, because of their delicate nature and the intricate process involved in harvesting them, lotus seeds can have a high price, especially in regions where they are foraged in the wild. In many Asian cultures, lotus plants symbolize purity, beauty and spiritual enlightenment, adding another layer to their value. The seeds, often seen in traditional desserts and savoury dishes, carry a subtle, nutty flavour that has become a culinary staple across countries like Japan and India. Matsutake Mushroom This is one of the most expensive mushrooms in the world, a Matsutake mushroom, often referred to as the pine mushroom due to its close relationship with pine forests. These highly coveted mushrooms have been a staple in Japanese cuisine and culture for over a millennium, with records of Matsutaka appearing in ancient Japanese poetry. It's the rarity and difficulty of finding Matsutaka that sends their values skyrocketing. Growing deep in forest floors, these mushrooms require skilled foragers and an ideal habitat that's slowly disappearing. Since these mushrooms grow deep under the forest floor, trained hunters search for them during a short season from September to November. The mushrooms are typically found nestled beneath layers of pine needles and other organic matter, making them difficult to spot and even more challenging to harvest without damaging them. In Japan, their natural habitat has been increasingly diminished due to the loss of these forests, making Matsutake mushrooms rarer and driving their prices up to around $1,000 per pound. But there's more than just rarity at play. The mushroom's distinctive aroma is often described as a mixture of cinnamon and pine, which makes them a highly sought after delicacy for tempura, soups, and grilled dishes in Japanese cuisine. Due to their limited availability and labor-intensive harvesting process, Matsutake mushrooms have become a symbol of both tradition and luxury in the world of fine dining. We now shift our focus to a different kind of luxury, one that's found in every sip. Teas and coffees have long held a special place in history and culture, representing centuries of tradition and craftsmanship. From ancient tea trees to the world's most exclusive coffee beans, these drinks offer experiences as rare and treasured as the ingredients themselves. Da Hong Pao Tea. Let's begin with one of the most prestigious teas in the world, the legendary Da Hong Pao Tea, cultivated in the Wuyi Mountains of China and known as the Big Red Robe. This rare oolong tea holds the title of the most expensive tea on the planet. But what exactly makes it so valuable? The answer lies in the ancient mother trees, which have produced leaves since the Ming Dynasty. These trees grow in rocky, mineral-rich soil giving Da Hong Pao its deep, earthy flavor with notes of dark chocolate and smokiness. The tea leaves are hand-picked, processed with precision, and only the finest quality leaves make it to the market. The rarity of these original trees, along with the delicate harvesting and processing methods, leads to prices of $1,400 per gram. To put that in perspective, that's 30 times the price of gold. In fact, at an auction, a batch of Da Hong Pao leaves from the original trees sold for an astonishing $10,000 per pot. The tea's high price, rarity and rich flavour make it an unforgettable experience for the few lucky enough to taste it. Black Ivory Coffee Among the most expensive teas and coffees in the world, Black Ivory Coffee is another strong contender, known not just for its smooth, rich flavour, but for its highly unusual production process. Sourced from the mountains of Thailand, the coffee beans are first eaten by elephants, passing through their digestive system before being collected, cleaned and roasted. This unique method, along with the rarity of the beans, makes black ivory coffee one of the most exclusive brews available. The reason behind this unusual process? As the beans are digested, the elephant's stomach enzymes break down the proteins in the coffee, which reduces its bitterness and results in a smoother, more refined taste. Or at least, that's the theory behind it. Each cup delivers flavours of chocolate, malt, spice and a hint of tamarind with absolutely no bitterness, a quality that sets it apart from any other coffee in the world. But producing black ivory coffee is no easy task. It takes 72 pounds of coffee cherries to yield just 2.2 pounds of finished beans making it one of the rarest and most exclusive coffees in the world. 
With a price tag of around $500 per pound, this coffee is more than just a beverage. It's an indulgent experience for those with a taste for the extraordinary. Whether savoured in high-end hotels or Michelin-starred restaurants, Black Ivory Coffee represents the height of luxury, offering a cup that's as rare as it is unforgettable. Kopi Luwak Coffee. Kopi Luwak, the rarest beverage in the world. If coffee beans passing through an elephant wasn't unusual enough, let's talk about Kopi Luwak, Indonesia's most expensive coffee. This time, the process involves a civet, a small nocturnal mammal. After the civet eats the coffee cherries, the beans are collected from its droppings, cleaned and processed, unlike the previous coffee, where the elephant's stomach digestion reduces its bitterness. The enzymes in the civet's digestive system alter the beans in a way that gives the coffee a smooth, rich flavour, with hints of chocolate and earthiness. While it might sound off-putting, this peculiar journey is what elevates Kopi Luwak coffee to premium status. Producing this coffee is incredibly labour-intensive. Foraging for wild civet droppings is a time-consuming task, and only small quantities of beans can be collected at a time. This scarcity, along with the novelty of its production, makes Kopi Luwak one of the most expensive coffees in the world, with prices reaching $100 to $600 per pound. Despite its fame, there has been controversy over animal welfare, as some producers have kept civets in cages to increase production. Ethical concerns have led to efforts in certifying wild forage beans as the premium choice for those who want to experience this unique coffee without supporting unethical practices. Of course, paying a premium for coffee that's been through an animal's digestive system? Well, that's a different story entirely. After exploring the rarest and most luxurious coffees and teas, we turn our attention to another indulgence, cheese, where centuries-old methods meet modern-day luxury. From farms to caves, the art of transforming milk into something truly extraordinary takes centre stage here with these exclusive cheeses. Swedish Moose Cheese. First up is one of the rarest and most expensive cheeses in the world, and it comes from an unlikely source, the moose. Produced exclusively at the Elgenshus farm in Björholm, Sweden, Swedish moose cheese is an extraordinary delicacy, with a steep price tag reaching around $500 per pound. But what makes this cheese so expensive? The answer lies in both the rarity of the milk and the labour-intensive process involved. The farm's three moose, Gullen, Juno and Hailsa, only produce milk for about five months each year from May to September. With only three moose producing milk, each one yields just 1.3 gallons per day. In comparison, a dairy cow can produce six to eight gallons daily. This significant difference highlights just how rare moose milk is. Handling these massive animals, which can weigh up to 1,300 pounds, requires both skill and patience, as they can be notoriously difficult and dangerous to manage. The milk itself is rich in proteins and fats, contributing to the cheese's unique buttery texture and deep flavour. This expensive cheese comes in four varieties – white mould, creamy blue, dried blue and a feta-style cheese. What makes Swedish moose cheese even more special is its high levels of omega-3 fatty acids, selenium and zinc, making it not only a luxury item, but also highly nutritious. Due to its limited production, just 660 pounds per year, and the meticulous care involved, Swedish moose cheese remains a rare and exclusive delicacy, often available only in upscale restaurants and specialty stores. Paul Donkey Cheese. One of the rarest and most expensive cheeses in the world comes from an unexpected source, donkeys. Pool donkey cheese is produced exclusively in the Zasavica Special Nature Reserve in Serbia. What makes this cheese so extraordinary is the labour-intensive process required to produce it. Made from 60% Balkan donkey milk and 40% goat milk, Pule donkey cheese requires about 6.6 .6 gallons of donkey milk to create just 2.2 pounds of cheese. Donkey milk is difficult to obtain because each female donkey, or jenny, produces only about half a gallon of milk per day, and milking is done by hand since machines are unsuitable for this process. This makes production not only laborious, but also incredibly limited, adding to the cheese's exclusivity and high price, around $600 per pound. The cheese itself has a soft, crumbly texture 
with a flavor reminiscent of manchego, offering a rich, nutty taste. The rarity of donkey milk and the meticulous care involved in its production have made Pudle donkey cheese a delicacy enjoyed by the wealthy and cheese connoisseurs alike. Bitto Storico Cheese Italy is home to some of the finest cheeses in the world and it brings us to Bitto Storico, one of the country's most expensive and ancient cheeses. Produced in the Valtellina Valley of Lombardy, this semi-hard cheese is made using a mix of cow's milk and a small portion of Arabic goat's milk, which allows it to age for an astonishingly long time, up to 18 years in some cases. But what makes Bitto Storico truly special is not just the time it spends aging, but the 400-year-old tradition behind it. The cows and goats graze freely in alpine meadows, feeding on wild grass and herbs, that infuse the milk and ultimately the cheese with a distinct flavor profile. The cheese is made directly on the mountainside during the summer months using copper cauldrons heated over wood fires, a practice that has remained unchanged since the 1600s. Aged for at least 70 days, Bitto Storico begins developing a rich, complex flavor that deepens as time passes. Starting with its mild, sweet profile when young, it gradually transforms into a more intense, spicier cheese with distinct notes of nuts, dried fruits and hay as it ages. It's a true delicacy for cheese enthusiasts. Some wheels of Bitto Storico have even fetched prices as high as $6,400 for a 15-year-old wheel, reflecting its rarity and artisanal craftsmanship and making it one of the most expensive cheeses in the world. Caccio Cavallo Podolico Next on our list is a cheese that's as rare as it is rich in flavor. Caccio Cavallo Podolico, often hailed as the pearl of southern Italy's cheese-making tradition. Produced exclusively from the milk of Podolica cows, a breed known for their resilience in the rugged Apennine Mountains, this cheese is both a culinary and cultural treasure. The cows graze freely, feeding on wild herbs such as fennel, licorice and myrtle which infuse the milk with unique aromas that give Caccio Cavallo Podolico its intense, complex flavor. The cheese itself has a semi-hard texture with a slightly granular mouthfeel and a distinct spiciness that develops as it ages. This delicacy, shaped like a chubby amphora and hung by ropes to mature, is typically aged for up to three years, with some varieties left to mature even longer allowing them to develop more intricate and nuanced flavors over time. The milk yield is low and the cows are only milked once a day, adding to the rarity and exclusivity of this cheese. The result is a cheese that is deeply connected to the land with notes of milk and hay and the lingering taste of the wild herbs that the cows feed on. Cazio Cavallo Podolico is often enjoyed on its own, paired with Southern Italian red wines, or accompanied by wild chestnut honey. We've just savoured some of the world's finest and most expensive cheeses, each crafted with centuries of tradition and meticulous attention to detail. But now, it's time to sink our teeth into something even more indulgent, the world's most expensive meats. Wagyu beef. First on our plate, Wagyu beef. Revered worldwide, this Japanese delicacy is synonymous with indulgence. Known for its stunning marbling and melt-in-your-mouth texture, Wagyu has redefined what it means to enjoy premium beef. The name Wagyu literally means Japanese cow, and it refers to four specific breeds that are capable of producing intensely marbled fat within their muscle tissue. This results in an unbelievably tender, buttery experience that's unlike anything else in the meat world. What makes Wagyu so exclusive and expensive is not just the marbling, but also the meticulous care taken during the cattle's upbringing. Wagyu cattle are raised in stress-free environments and fed a carefully crafted diet to promote this luxurious fat distribution. To give you an idea of its value, some cuts of Wagyu can sell for over $200 per pound with some fetching even higher prices. The intricate marbling of fat not only makes the meat incredibly tender, but also gives it a rich, savory flavor, often described as meaty or buttery, that makes Wagyu so sought after. 
And if you want to go really premium, one of the most famous and expensive types of Wagyu is Kobe beef. To earn the Kobe label, the beef must meet incredibly strict standards and only a small fraction of Wagyu qualifies. This makes Kobe beef a true rarity on the global market and a coveted delicacy for those seeking the absolute best beef. Iberian ham. From the lush pastures of Japan, we now journey to the sun-drenched lands of Spain, a country renowned for its wine, olive oil, and perhaps most famously, chamon ibérico, or Iberian ham in Spanish. One of the most expensive meats in the world, chamon ibérico is much more than just a delicacy. It's a symbol of Spanish tradition. Derived from black Iberian pigs, this ham stands out due to the unique combination of the pig's free-range lifestyle and their acorn-rich diet. The finest quality, chamon ibérico de Belota, comes from pigs that roam the dehesas, vast oak forests, grazing on acorns, wild herbs and grass. This exclusive diet infuses the meat with its signature nutty, earthy flavour and the soft, melt-in-your-mouth fat that makes Iberian ham a prized indulgence. But what truly sets Hamon Iberico apart is the meticulous curing process, which can last anywhere from two to four years. During this time, the ham undergoes a slow transformation, with the fat breaking down to enhance its rich, deep flavours. Oleic acid from the acorns, the same fat found in olive oil, gives the meat its healthy profile and incredible silkiness. Then there's the grading system. Only a small percentage of these hams earn the Pata Negra label, signifying that the meat is not only acorn fed, but also from purebred black Iberian pigs. These rare hams can fetch over $1,000 per leg, with the finest cuts sometimes reaching up to $4,500. To enjoy this delicacy, the ham is usually sliced paper thin by master Jamoneros, ham cutters in Spanish allowing the complex flavours and textures to be fully appreciated with every bite. Some say that even better with some manchego cheese and red wine. We've savoured the world's finest meats, each one a masterpiece of flavour and exclusivity. But now, we turn our attention to ingredients that pack an immense punch in much smaller quantities. The most expensive exotic spices and sweetness. These tiny yet powerful ingredients have influenced cuisines and cultures for centuries with their bold flavours and captivating histories. Saffron. Starting with the crown jewel of spices, saffron. Often referred to as red gold, saffron is renowned for its distinct flavour, vivid colour and labour-intensive harvesting process. To put it in perspective, nearly 75,000 crocus sativus flowers are needed to produce just one pound of this luxurious spice, making it one of the most expensive ingredients in the world. Its rarity is driven by both the labour required and its short flowering season, just two weeks each year, making saffron not only one of the most luxurious, but also one of the rarest ingredients in the culinary world. Harvesting saffron is an intricate, time-consuming process. Each flower has only three delicate stigmas, which must be carefully hand-picked. This labour-intensive method, combined with the need for specific climate conditions, contributes to saffron's high price. Iran, India and Spain are some of the largest producers, with Iran being the top global exporter. But saffron's value extends beyond its price tag. Its history is just as rich, dating back over 3,500 years. Saffron has been used as a dye, a perfume and even as a medicine. Its unmistakable earthy floral flavour adds depth to dishes from paella to Indian biryani, making it a beloved staple in cuisines around the world. Tahitian Vanilla From the lush islands of French Polynesia comes one of the world's most expensive and sought-after spices, Tahitian Vanilla Beans. Unlike more common vanilla varieties, Tahitian Vanilla is known for its floral, fruity notes and distinctive aroma which is softer and sweeter than its counterparts. What makes Tahitian vanilla beans so special? Grown in the nutrient-rich volcanic soils of the Society Islands, this vanilla is unique in both flavour and origin. Like many of the expensive foods we've explored, it's not just the taste that elevates it, it's the effort and care required to produce it. The vanilla orchid must be hand-pollinated and the beans are carefully harvested, cured and dried over several months 
Just as producing Wagyu beef or crafting moose cheese involves a meticulous, labour-intensive process, growing Tahitian vanilla demands careful attention to environmental factors. This luxurious vanilla is often used in gourmet desserts, perfumes and even high-end liqueurs, adding a touch of exoticism and depth to everything it touches. With prices often reaching $600 per kilogram, Tahitian vanilla is more than just a flavouring, it's a rare indulgence. So, if you're lucky enough to get your hands on it, be sure to use it wisely. Every little bit counts. Manuka Honey After exploring the world of vanilla's rare floral notes, we now shift our focus to another natural wonder with a sweet touch. Manuka Honey Hailing from the remote hillsides of New Zealand, this honey is made from the nectar of the manuka tree, which only blooms for a short period each year, between four to six weeks. Manuka honey is as rare as it is unique. Its limited flowering season, combined with the remote locations of the manuka trees, makes the harvesting process both time-sensitive and labour-intensive. Manuka honey also has powerful antibacterial properties, thanks to high concentrations of methyl glyoxal, MGO, a compound that gives the honey its unique healing abilities. Used for centuries to treat everything from wounds to sore throats, Manuka honey has earned a reputation as a natural remedy with potent medicinal properties. However, this high demand, coupled with limited supply, results in prices that can reach up to $225 per pound for the highest grade honey. Manuka honey's distinct earthy flavor, thick texture and health benefits have made it a staple in the wellness and luxury food industries alike. Whether used in skin creams, wound care or simply as a sweetener, this honey is prized for its rarity and effectiveness, making it one of the most valuable sweeteners in the world. White Truffles When it comes to expensive ingredients, most think of black caviar or black truffles. But just as Alma's caviar stands apart with its rare golden hue, white truffles from Alba, Italy, take exclusivity to another level in the world of fungi. So why truffles are so expensive? These diamonds of the kitchen grow underground, typically near the roots of oak, hazelnut and chestnut trees. What makes white truffles so special is their intense earthy aroma, a unique blend of garlic, mushrooms and moist soil that elevates them to a prize status in gourmet dishes across the globe. Harvesting white truffles is an art in itself. These precious fungi can only be found during a short season, from September to December, in the forests around Piedmont, particularly in the Thangue region. Trained truffle hunting dogs help uncover these hidden treasures, sniffing out their unmistakable scent from beneath the forest floor. Once found, the truffles are carefully extracted by hunters to preserve their delicate structure. As for their value, white truffles command astronomical prices, with some selling for up to $6,000 per pound, depending on the season and availability. Their scarcity and labour-intensive harvesting process contribute to these prices, with the most exceptional truffles being auctioned off for tens of thousands of dollars. In one famous auction, a large white truffle fetched a jaw-dropping $300,000. White truffles are best enjoyed fresh and thinly shaved over hot dishes like pasta, risotto or eggs, where their rich aroma can truly shine. Their delicate flavour does not require heavy seasoning, allowing the truffle itself to take centre stage in any dish it graces. Pink Himalayan Salt The next expensive ingredient takes us to the Kura salt mine in Pakistan. The origin of the renowned Pink Himalayan Salt this ancient salt was created over 800 million years, making it one of the oldest and purest forms of salt on the planet. The striking pink colour comes from trace amounts of iron oxide, giving it a distinct hue that has captured global attention. 100 grams of it can cost $5 to $8, up to 20 times more than generic table salt. So, why is it so expensive? While pink Himalayan salt is often marketed as a healthier alternative, to regular table salt because of its mineral content, the actual differences are quite small. Himalayan salt is about 98% sodium chloride, with only 2% made up of trace minerals like calcium, potassium and magnesium. These traces of minerals are present in such small amounts that they don't offer any significant health benefits. Despite its minimal difference from regular salt, its exotic appeal, purity and unique colour 
have made it a popular luxury item, often used not only in cooking but in spa treatments and home decor as well. Price difference is mostly driven by marketing and its aesthetic appeal. Bird's Nest We've reached the final stop on our most expensive food list and it's arguably the most intriguing of all, the bird's nest or swiftlet nest. Made from the hardened saliva of swiftlets, this delicacy has been a luxury item in Chinese cuisine for centuries with a long history dating back to the Ming Dynasty. The process of making this nest is truly fascinating. The swiftlet bird uses its saliva to form a gelatinous nest, sticking it to the walls of high caves in Southeast Asia. These nests solidify as they dry, becoming the highly sought after ingredient known as bird's nest. Harvesting these nests isn't an easy task, as skilled collectors must scale steep, often dangerous cave walls to retrieve them. Once collected, the nests are meticulously cleaned to remove impurities, which is one of the reasons they're so expensive. Prices can reach up to $1,300 per pound due to the labour-intensive collection and cleaning process, as well as their long-standing cultural significance. In Chinese tradition, bird's nest soup has been seen as a symbol of health and longevity. It's believed to have numerous health benefits, from boosting immunity to improving skin health, making it a prized delicacy in both fine dining and traditional Chinese medicine. From coffee beans passed through animals to an 18-year-old cheese, the world of the most expensive foods is truly full of surprises. Which of these jaw-dropping ingredients caught you off guard? Let us know in the comments. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to hit that subscribe button and join us at Stella Eureka for more fascinating discoveries. Share this with friends who appreciate the extraordinary. It's a great way to support the channel. Until next time, this is Stella Eureka, signing off.